Hi everybody, this is Mike Marlowe with Holiday Bright Lights. I look forward to being able to share with you the Holiday Bright Lights Estimating Program. Uh, this program is designed to help uh, speed up your estimating process to give your clients a, a nice professional proposal and then also give you a nice snapshot of what product you need to purchase as well as being able to give you a, um, a margin as well as a profit estimate. So. As you open up and load up your disk, you have the icon will automatically pop up to your program. Both of our softwares aren't licensed, so you can actually be able to put that on multiple uh, laptops. And uh, so when we open this up, it's a, it's a basic Excel-based type program. And so where you have your first step, as I would always say, encourage you to remember information. This is where you put your company information. You load up your logo as much as possible. Uh, if you have JPEG, it gives you kind of the, the images that should be in format. So the next step will be set your your default. Default, this is where your man hours are going to be at. Um, this is right out of our member's manual uh, where we would do recommendations. Uh, but it, ideally, you know, maybe it's something where you want to change some things around. We can do that right here in, as well. Your tax information, you can change this to... 8.5 or 6 and then plus 1. Um, maybe we do product and storage or maybe it's just in labor that you do. Just contact your account, county department or your accountant to make sure that you actually have the right taxes to put into the product. This is where you have default wise, you're going to have 50% markup, 55 bucks a man hour. This is actually a, a general rule. The program is set up so that it, it calculates your, your profits and margin off of your paying your guys 15 bucks a man hour. Uh, so if you're paying a little bit less, great. If you're paying a little bit more, just kind of factor that in when you look at that. It is an estimation. Uh, over the years, we've actually uh, come up with a formula where 15% of that product sales price uh, will be uh, another 15% will be added on for extensions and timers as well as uh, you can always set up a minimum uh, for your area that's comfortable for your company. 45% uh, of it, well, this comes from your install rate, as well as now you got your storage, 7% uh, is coming off your your sales price itself. Now let's say after you're on the East Coast, you might have to bump that up to 10. It all depends on where you're using it. If you're using your own building, kind of factor in, factor in what a cubic feet would be and then kind of figure out how much that would, um, percentage that would work off of a certain just a job. Uh, one of the things I'm proud to be able to say is that we have, uh, you know, categories where we can kind of add these in. It's 45 percent. Let's say line four. Let's bring that down to 55. These are actually default by the categories that we have established in our price list. So this is this way you're able to kind of dictate which products you want to maybe, let's say if it goes down to light links and you're like, you know what, light links are, are very easy to put up, I can save labor by doing so, why don't I go ahead and just do 25%, okay, which is great. You're you're trying to look at this as a, I'm, the product is just a one-time sale, it's actually a vehicle into getting more clients, and then the more clients on the rehangs, that's where you can kind of come back and maybe, you know what, I'm going to go my price a little lower, but I'm going to actually charge more per man because this is what's going to dictate your second year, third year, fourth year, fifth year uh, sale. So as we got all that saved, we can close that. Then we go into customer information. So if we had to add a customer, we could do so. That just go to this information below. Even if you had to re-edit a customer, you can do so as well as that. Pretty simple and straightforward. So by, by getting out of the menu, just press close. It goes and takes you back. Here's your proposal information. So we're going to reset this. Let's say we have a light link. And it's non incandescent light link. And we're going to go Blizzard, which is one of our top sellers. And we're just going to go up to 24. And then we had, uh, let's say, like you said, let's do a, a wreath. Mixed normal wreath, which is very popular, 48 inch wreath. And then we're going to add a bow. There's no subcategory for bows. So it just goes right into the sizes. Say these these red bows, the gold trim, are um, fade resistant and very um, constructive 
So it's not like a paper thin bow. It is, this is bow is going to last you many, a couple seasons. So as we have this set up, now we go into our, we're going to hang our light length. We just move this up to 24. We have one, one uh, wreath that we're hanging up. Uh, sometimes, remember, this is half hour. Maybe it's like you just want to give yourself a little bit of play. So here's your product up to 455. Apply that. Here's your notes. Uh, Pre-season warning. When, uh, when a company stores product. Then 50% uh, down to secure project or slash schedule. Save that. Here's your adjustments. Okay, here you already have your taxes. This is 60 bucks in taxes. It's going to go to the state and city. Here's where you got your synopsis of where a lot of everything's at from your 50%. You can see where you had your, it shows your category markups at 40%, um, as well as then you get your margin. Now, your storage and your timers to get into this estimated profit are set up as a 40% cost of what that 15% number is going to be. Uh, that usually is a good 40 50% general rule of that. So you can get a nice little markup this way. Uh, if we need to go back in, let's say if we have to... So as we go through, we can kind of look at here's path proposals we need to reopen up. And we can close that. Oops, sorry. And if we needed to go into um, view and print. And that's an Excel-based program. Obviously, you can see everything. Uh, nice proposal will come out. Uh, you can use Primo PDF to make it to use a printer uh, to create a PDF that way. That'd be the easiest way to kind of create a PDF. Or you can just print it out and show the customer right here on, on, on here and then print off later and put it in the mail. But this gives everybody a rendition. Okay, here's your product. Here's your, your estimate, your extension quarter timers. Here's your install rate. Here's your taxes. So 1486. Now we have a removal of 204 with our storage at $75. This won't take up a lot of room for storage. 75 bucks is efficient. General rule is look from anything from eight to, to fifteen bucks a month on storage. Anything on uh, the big three D items, trees, things of that nature, obviously they'll go past that. Uh, yeah, as you see, here's your estimated second year. Your estimated second year at seven thirty four is actually going to be your install, install, removal, and storage added together. It gives you a nice little idea of what your price is going to be. Now, um, obviously, here's your notes. Here's some legal beagle stuff to kind of, you know, make sure you're covered on your end as being a company. So that's kind of the proposal itself. It doesn't take very long, but it also gives you a, a great way to get a synopsis of, of the job itself, if that makes sense. So if you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. We are here to kind of help uh, facilitate this program to even new heights even next year and year after so we always encourage feedback from our member base but uh, remember uh, this program is about 125 for our members for upgrades it comes with the updated price list but if you actually order with your platinum program your platinum program which is going to be both softwares and a, your catalog a case of catalogs for 400 you actually have another file that i will send you to have the updated platinum pricing loaded up in the software, which is key. Uh, so take a moment. If you have any questions, please give us a call at Holiday Bright Lights. And again, this is Mike Marlowe. I wish you the best this season, and I look forward for everyone to be prosperous. Have a great day.